Long ago in the land of Uz, there lived a man named Job. Job was the most influential man in the East, who stood for righteousness and God. Through trials, he lost his family, his health, and his home. But because of his faith, he was restored by all who knew him. Today, in the land of Hollywood, there lives a man named Stephen. Stephen is mostly inconsequential in the West and apparently stands against sharks in Venice. Through an unrelenting series of poor decisions and bad acting, he lost his home, his wealth, and his dignity. Yet Stephen somehow has a charity set up for him, something about God and stuff, and he hopes to be restored by begging for handouts. But also in the land of Hollywood lives a man named Joss. Joss is one of the most influential men in the West and stands for strong, deeply emotional female characters who are smoking hot and could kick your ass. Firefly was fucking awesome. Dollhouse was pretty good too. I didn't watch much of Angel, but I'm sure it wasn't bad. It's totally in my Netflix queue, but that's because my girlfriend thinks David Boreanaz is hot. She even started TiVoing Bones, and at first I was like, what the F, but it's actually kind of watchable. Anyway, Joss's shows were cancelled, but Joss isn't asking for money, Joss doesn't need it, because Joss Whedon doesn't suck. So without any permission whatsoever, we have established Restore Joss Whedon and his smoking hot ass kicking chicks.org. Our mission is to see more episodes of Firefly, Dollhouse, and possibly a Serenity sequel. Actually, it should be a prequel, because Alan Tudyk is awesome, and we never really got to know the backstory of Shepard Book, and they both died in that movie. Shit, I totally spoiled that for some of you, didn't I? My bad. Join the movement. Visit Restore Joss Whedon and his smoking hot ass kicking chicks.org, and all the glory will go to Joss.